Hello Virgos, welcome to Beauty Tutorial and this reading is from 22nd of October to 28th of October. So let's check what are the messages for you. Six of Pentacles. The Battle Wagon. Eight of Wands. Five of Chalices. Ten of Wands. Okay, Virgo. What does Ten of Wands seems like? Um, this journey is unending. You might be feeling like every time you try to fix something, something comes up again. Or you can say that uh, the challenges are overwhelming. At this point, you might be feeling like in your relationship, you try to sort out something, and uh, another one is quick to follow. I mean another problem and um, this could be exhausting this could be tiring this could be draining your energy at this point and uh, with this five of chalices you might already be thinking that uh, um, you made a wrong choice or this person is not meant for you this relationship is not the right one for you in fact um, the universe is telling you that if you choose to work on this relationship it's always there with this three of cups i mean you cannot work more than this but if you still wanted to uh, be there or if you still want to be in this relationship definitely you can carry this ten of wands and reach the destination but at the same time virgo with this eight of wands the tarot is telling you that um, you need to let something new and positive come into your life in fact, if you are feeling tired and done in your relationship, you will soon find someone. If you are single, you are going to find someone who will uh, feel like your home. And uh, seems like uh, this new energy will kind of uh, nourish you. Here we have six of pentacles. With the six of pentacles, where it looks like you need help. Okay, and there is nothing wrong with that. You might be feeling unappreciated, you might be feeling tired, you might be feeling drained, you might be feeling that nobody understands you, especially this person. And you might be feeling like, um, you know, uh, you need someone to share your feelings or to tell them how you feel at this point. To, you know, take your problems and help you. And the universe is going to do exactly that. The universe will send you someone who will um, give you answers and who will help you understand what you deserve. In fact, at this point, seems like Virgo, you need to uh, get back to the point where you were. You need to gather the strength to be yourself and you don't have to do it alone. The universe is telling you that um, it's going to send you someone or it's going to show you the way how you should be going ahead in your life. You don't have to look for anything. You don't have to seek anything. If you are broken, if you are devastated, you just relax. I mean, um, sit at your place, 
let those emotions come up deal with those emotions that's that's your only job and rest of the things will be set up by the universe someone will show up unexpectedly maybe an old friend or um, someone you trust could be a family member could be anyone okay and they will help you could be a stranger as well and um, you will talk to them and you will feel like okay I was looking for this person and um, you know they will give you a lot of relief you will know that um, it's not always your job and you don't have to do it alone I mean to deal with these kind of emotions we have the battle wagon here that is about uh, making a decision you might be feeling indecisive but you might be feeling like you need to get out of this place as soon as possible do not push yourself where it goes that's right you might not be feeling comfortable at this place but you need to deal with your emotions and uh, you need to know what's exactly uh, not going according to you okay because uh, if you don't do that you would never be able to um, heal yourself completely and that will keep coming up again and again okay so this is the reading um, of course for this week but it is a journal one so it may not resonate with everyone the energy could be reversed as well you can also check your moon and rising sign let's go ahead and check some more messages for you messages for Virgos. Queen of Pentacles, the Star, Seven of Athens, Knight of Wands, and Nature. So here we have Queen of Pentacles, Virgo. The Tower is telling you. Think about yourself first because this Queen of Pentacles is uh, totally complete in herself. In fact, uh, this card is about looking at the practical side of life. Possibly you have been helping this person all the time. You were trying to do everything for them and in an effort to help them, you have actually lost uh, your energy, your um, you can say your peace of mind or your courage because you have been courageous for so long and now you feel like you cannot fight anymore with the star Virgo it's all right to be tired the star is telling you that um, try to focus the light inside you I mean this is about the light inside you it's your spirit calling you to Pay attention to yourself with this seven of eight ends, Virgo. You may feel like um, you are looking back, back again and again, even if you are trying to move on. But that's something uh, that will happen. You know, whenever you will try to move on, this is not something unusual. And uh, this Knight of Wands is telling you that you have the courage to take control of your life. You have got the courage to make the right decisions and. Uh, nature here is telling that this person might have kept you trapped for so long but you might be um, seeing the truth before your eyes where you may have this feeling that this person has been using you or they were not reciprocating your love they were taking you for granted in fact uh, now you know that they were actually setting up a trap I mean here by trap I mean that this person was manipulating you they were trying to make you feel like uh, you know they deserve it all and uh, you're not doing anything special this is very usual so here at this point it's time to open your, open your eyes and realize the truth and see the light inside your spirit let's check an oracle message for you 
Valerium, Divine Healing. Honor your sensitivity, retreat to recharge and heal. Your light can support others. So here this card is telling you that you need to honor your sensitivity. You are too sensitive this time or in this week. And it's time to pay attention to your emotions because shutting off those emotions will only make the situation out of control. Try to deal with it. In fact, you don't have to do it alone. Talk to people. And um, you need to recharge and heal first. Your light can support others. You are valuable. Remember that. Many others look forward to you when it comes to healing and um, to others you mean a lot so at this point you need to take care of yourself so here we have the reading for this week i hope you enjoy it thanks for watching till next video bye